G'day ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to another GTA Online video. Today we're going to be showing you some money methods in the game. Some of these you will not require any money. Some of these you will need to require some things. But if you guys enjoyed today's video, then leaving a like and subscribing is greatly appreciated. If there's another method you'd consider, then let me know in the comments down below. But without further ado, let's go. Alright, so let's start this list out with the HSW time trial. All you need to do is go over to it, press right D-pad and start it up. Now just set your waypoint point to the end destination go back to the time trial quit the time trial through your phone and then you can go and restart the time trial once again so that when you do the time trial a waypoint will be set rather than you aimlessly driving and trying to find the end destination so upon completing you'll make two hundred and fifty thousand dollars and i'll just reiterate this is only for next gen and this is only a weekly time trial so in the meantime i'm just going to get these two money methods out of the way that do require some money so this week of course there are some weekly challenges that are available for the dispatch work if you're unfamiliar with how this works it's actually quite simple so if you do own a law enforcement vehicle better known as a police or cop car in gta online these were released as part of the bottom dollar bounties update then you can just simply go into one of those vehicles press r3 or the right stick on your controller that's if you're playing with a controller and you can just request some dispatch work through vincent press right d-pad and you can begin the work at hand unfortunately these are not paying double money but you'll still make $25,000 for completing one and if you complete six this week as part of the weekly challenge you'll earn an additional $100,000 which is a nice little bonus. So next up is the RC Bandito time trial. You do not need to own one of these. Of course it is preferred if you do as it makes your work a little bit easier on your front. You can afford to make some mistakes. If you don't have a custom one it's going to be a little bit slower obviously but they're still really fun and easy to complete. They're paying double money this week actually and even better these times time trials rotate each day. So for completing one, you'll earn $100,000. And if you do some quick math, over a span of seven days or one week, you can earn an additional 700,000 from these. All right, next up is the regular time trial. If you guys go to motorcycles on the Southern San Andreas Super Autos website, you guys can go and purchase a Batty 801 for 15K. So if you're a new player, I highly recommend doing this. And then you can go and start the time trial up called Grove Street. So we'll use the same method as we did for the HSW time trial. If you guys aren't familiar, set a waypoint once you start the time trial up, quit the job through your phone, and then just press right D-pad to begin the time trial once again. So yeah, once you have started your ascent to complete the time trial, there's not really too many tips I would give you guys except try to perform as many wheelies as possible. Just make your way through the waypoint and upon completing, you'll earn $101,000 for just over one minute's work. So, so far, we are making some pretty decent cash for not too much work. It doesn't really take you too long as well. So next up, if you're looking for a fun way to earn some cash and you may need to put a little bit more effort into this it's going to be the stunt races so you can obviously either find this through the main menu when you first log into gta you could also just go through the pause menu or you could just quick join a stunt race through your phone these are paying double money this week and even better four times rp so it's a great method to just rank up and there are a few tips that i would like to give you guys with this so when you are starting a stunt race try and get the boost right off the line so you guys can see the payout for these as well do vary depending on the race that you are in how many players are in the lobby and the time or duration of the race but yeah just quickly some other tips make sure you take advantage of slip streams and also if catch up is on sometimes you could actually hang back in a race and come back in the final lap or two but yeah there's some quick tips these do pay out really well if you've got a full lobby and you actually find yourself making now a million dollars in no time from these so just another quick one for those players who are beginners or you could even be an OG or an experienced player but this is something I do recommend you do every day whether you own a business or whether you don't own any businesses it is the G's cash so there'll be a little sort of like circular perimeter that you'll need to go and search that area and you're just going to be looking for a box that you need to collect typically the pay ranges from about 15 to 20k but you'll also be rewarded with some ammo and some snacks there's also stash houses which this more or less actually applies for those who do or do not own businesses so if you're a new player this is going to pay you a 
around $30,000. Whereas if you do own a business in the game, then it's just gonna resupply one of those businesses with some supplies. Both of these methods take you less than five minutes and if they're nearby, it's even better. So we're gonna move on to the junk energy time trial. This is one I would recommend you guys do. And again, these actually update every day, similar to the RC Bandito time trial. However, they're not paying double money. They'll still make you $50,000 every day, which is a nice little bonus to have on top of everything else. Now, let's move on. We've got the junk energy time trials or Sorry, I should actually point out the skydives, which is even better. This is paying double money and RP this week. And they're really fun and just actually quite therapeutic to do. There's 10 of these in total and they will rotate every day once again. So how these work is basically you have a challenge time that you need to try and complete the time trial within that part time, similar to a time trial. And then if you land in that gold circle at the end, then you will get a gold medal and be rewarded with $10,000. So if you do 10 of them, you'll earn $100,000 dollars each day from these so if you're a new player i hope that all of these methods helped you guys out there are other methods that you guys could do you could even chuck in the clock and bell farm raid if you're a beginner but ladies and gentlemen that is it for this money guide video i really do hope it helped you guys out and you did pick something up from it so if you did leave a like and subscribe it's greatly appreciated take care and i'll see you in my next video